we have here a, a planned verse actual view of, of the session. And Matt, this is you know a, an important thing not only for for you but any sport that's well any, any sport that's involving any sort of load really to understand uh, where you want to go, where you've come from, um, and some some movements and analysis around that. Talk me through uh, the, the plan versus actual here for, for those that are watching um, and what some of the key metrics are for here and what some of the, the things that you look for. Yeah, sure. So it, it, um, what, what's really nice about the plan load is everyone in our team, including coaches, now have access to it. And I think the example you brought up here is a rehab player. Oh, sorry, someone who got injured. But, um, yeah, we've – we've um, so what we, – we're still working on what this is – this visualization is going to look like finally but what you see here is both a weekly a breakdown of weekly load um, at the top of the screen um, uh, we, we've just picked a few key metrics as a as a visual to begin with and so one is um, total distance um, and it breaks down total dis it breaks down distance of running um, we've got our sprinting meter meters in there we've we've got individualized zones that we apply to um to our to our athletes so um this is individualized to that specific athlete um uh, as well as um um uh, some other metrics but the the purpose of it is is really for anyone in our team to be able to to have a quick snapshot and look at what um both the players actual loads have been but then also um for our planned loads um, for that particular individual to be entered in in advance. Um, what it gives you is a, is a shape of the curve um, uh, representation for that particular individual. Um, this probably isn't the best example because the curve's sort of all over the place there, but um, we, uh, <laughs> um, it just gives you a nice little uh, um, representation of, of what that shape, shape is for that person. And then right at the bottom of that, if you scroll all the way down, you can actually break up the uh, the session content for that person as, as well, um, which goes into a bit more depth um, um, per metric that you're looking at. 